here's how to delete domains from your Shopify web store. So first you wanna to head to the Shopify dashboard. I have this open up right here. And what we want to do is go to the bottom left where we see the settings button, go ahead and tap on that. Then on the left-hand side, we wanna to go to where it says domains right here. Go ahead and click on that. This will take us to the domains page where we can see all the domains that we have connected to our Shopify store currently. We have the custom domain that I added right here, and we also have the default Shopify domain. So let's say we wanna remove this custom domain that we added to our Shopify store. What we can do is actually click on the original Shopify domain. So this should be something like a random string of characters, .myshopify.com. We wanna go ahead and click on that. And then we wanna click where it says change domain type on the right hand side. And instead of having this set to redirecting domain, we actually want to set this to our primary domain. So go ahead and click on primary domain and then click on where it says change domain type. And what that's going to allow us to do is go back by clicking the back button here, go to our custom domain that we added. So for my case, it's the evandustech.org. And now we have the option to actually delete this now that it's no longer our primary domain. So you should see a delete domain button at the bottom here. If you go ahead and click on that, it's gonna ask if you're sure you want to remove the domain from your Shopify store, go ahead and click on where it says remove. It should say successfully remove domain at the bottom. And now our Shopify store should be set to this default domain. And in some cases you may have an extra domain like this one, for example, with the www.prefix. So if you got want to go ahead and just remove this as well, click on it, click on delete domain, and then click on where it says remove. So now the only domain that we have is the default one that comes with the Shopify store. We have no custom domains attached to the store. And if we ever wanted to add a custom domain again, all we could do is click on the connect existing domain, or we can buy a domain straight from Shopify. So if this video helped you guys out, please leave a like. But that's going to do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope this helped you out.